Hello everyone, it's Barney here and I work on the trade counter at FastKey Services and in today's video, we're going to show you how to reset the combination code on the MLM Liebman ML59 series combination locks. This is the vertical variant, but this will also apply to the left hand and right hand variants. This method will also include code recovery if necessary. Okay, so here is our lock in question. Now this has been set to a random combination and I genuinely don't know what it is. So in order to both recover and reset this code, we are going to need our master key just here. And we'll also need a pin. I'll show you what that does in a moment. So the first thing to do is we take our master key, put it into the lock, and we need to hold this knob in place, and then we can turn the key 180 degrees like so. Now we take our pin, and you can see at the top of the knob here, there's this button. We need to press that down and at the same time, turn the knob into this position about here. So let's do that now. So when you press the button in, you'll hear a click, like so. Now turn the knob and you should hear another click, like that. Okay, now we can take the pin out as that's no longer needed. Now what we need to do is turn each of these dials until they lock into place. You'll feel them lock into place and you should be able to hear a click as well. So let's now do just that. So let's turn the first one. An important thing is, is to take your time with it. Okay, so we've got an eight on that one. Okay, now I'll turn the next one. Okay, we've got a three on that one. On to the next. We have a nine. On to the last one, and now we have a two. Okay, so that should be the code. Now we can turn the key back round and remove it. At this point, we have two options. We can now either retain this code, turn the dial back to the lock position, and then that'll be the code saved and retained once more. But we're going to reset this one. So to reset it, we turn the dial further down to the right, and the code should scramble like this. So you can see that it scrambled all back to zero. Now we turn the dial back up to the top, and now the code has been fully reset on this lock.